Well, it's not often you get to witness a person you get closer to qualifying for the Olympics, but we got that chance this week in Gaithersburg. Athletes from across the country and even right here in Maryland showed off their skills to try and make the U.S. climbing national team. Uh, from basketball to tennis and soccer, women's sports are gaining more attention. And this year, women will play an even more prominent role on the Olympic stage. As we celebrate Women's History Month, we take a look at the historic nature of this year's competition. The countdown to the Summer Olympics is on with Paris hosting the 2024 Games. The first time Paris hosted was in 1900 when the Olympics marked a major milestone. Women competed in the Games for the first time. While the poster for the Games shows a woman holding swords, Olympic officials say they didn't actually compete in fencing for another 24 years. Okay, back to the 1900 Games. Out of nearly 1,000 athletes, 22 were women who competed in tennis, sailing, croquet, equestrian, and golf. 124 years later, the Olympics have reached gender parity. There will be the same number of men competing as women. I'm definitely going to be watching this year. Um, I'll actually be in Paris. Baltimore native and two-time Olympic gold medalist Angel McCautry will be there. McCautry helped Team USA win gold in women's basketball in London in 2012 and Rio de Janeiro in 2016. I'll be there to watch the women's basketball team um, as they run and just give them help give them my expertise on what I did to be an Olympian and how to win the gold. McCautry says that she's glad to see the world paying more attention to female athletes. This is the time, like it's growing, every sport, every sport. It's not just basketball, it's not just uh, uh, tennis, it's all of them. And now I'm going to say that it's going to continue to grow where women are going to make their first million dollar contract. It's not just about what happens on the field, court, pitch, or ring. McCautry says the ripple effects transcend the world of sports. You know, women are always giving back to the community. They have, um, you know, a lot of things they do to get back. So they're going to make their first million dollar contract and watch how they infect, uh, affect the community with bigger contracts. Katie Ledecky has won more individual Olympic races than any other female swimmer, and now she's telling her story in her own words. The Bethesda native is about to publish her first memoir entitled Just Add Water. Ledecky began journaling when she was 14, leading up to the London Games in 2012. These journals are part of her memoir. Just Add Water comes out on June the 11th before the Paris Games.